What's up everybody, Sanitary 103, always encouraging clean eating and clean and healthy lifestyle. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you my version of protein sludge. You might be wondering, what is protein sludge? Well, it's basically a concoction of protein powder, some natural peanut butter, a bunch of other good quality ingredients. This is an easy recipe to make, an easy snack. It helps satisfy your sweet tooth, especially if you're dieting, it's very easy to make. With that being said, let me show you the prep work and the stuff that you're gonna need. So right here, now there are a lot of different concoctions on YouTube you might see, but what I'm going to be using is some protein powder. This is the vanilla flavor. It's going to be two scoops of that. I'm going to be using some fat-free whipped topping right here. A little bit of uh, pecans that I chopped up. That's going to serve as a topping, give it the uh, meal a good little crunch, the good uh, crunch on the snack. Some natural uh, peanut butter. A little bit of ground cinnamon. And then I have some pure almond milk right here, and this is also uh, the vanilla protein flavor. So the vanilla and the vanilla is going to work together. So it's very, very easy, guys. What you want to do is I'm going to use two scoops of the protein powder into a little bowl. There's one scoop there. And there's two scoops there. Right into the bowl. Next, I'm going to use one spoonful of the uh, fat-free whipped topping. Just use roughly one scoop like that. Put that in. Next, I'm going to use one uh, spoonful of the uh, peanut butter. This is from Justin's. This is a great brand. Just like that. Good healthy fats in there. Delicious. Then some ground cinnamon. Just kind of eyeball it. It's kind of. It's good right there. The pecan halves are going to be for later. And then right here, this is the almond milk. And um, you want to just kind of eyeball it. You want to splash a little bit like this. Okay, like that, and then you want to start mixing it and stirring it. It's going to be some trial and error. You don't want it too, too clumpy, but the consistency is going to form in a second. Just add a little bit more. Okay. You just want to mix it. And as you can see, as it's forming, it's kind of getting into like a, a paste kind of. And see, see that? See the consistency? It's a little bit thick. It's exactly what you want. Now at this point, some people like to just eat it like this. If you're pressed for time, you can do that. But in this case, I'm actually going to put it in the freezer for about 10 minutes. It's going to be like a little dessert. So I'm going to pop this in the freezer now for 10 minutes. Right in here. Running out of room a little bit, but I'll put it at the top of here. So I'll just wait about 10 minutes, set my timer, and then I'll put the pecans on top and go over the nutritional facts. I'll see you in 10 minutes. Welcome back guys, been about eight to 10 minutes. I'm gonna take out the sludge from the freezer. And I like putting it in the freezer because it's like a dessert, like I said, it's very, very cold. I love it. So if you look right here, it's a little bit harder. If you put it in the freezer too, too long, obviously it's gonna get too hard. But if that happens and you forget, no big deal. Just let it sit out for a little bit and it'll start to form like this. So now, for the toppings, go pecan halves right here. Just get some crunch and just kind of pour that in like that. That looks awesome, right? And I'm gonna, this is really, really chewy, but I'm gonna take a bite on camera. Just like that, guys. Here we go. I won't talk about my mouthful, but that's absolutely delicious. I guarantee it. Uh, be sure to give that a try. And as far as the nutritional facts, it's gonna range a little bit based on how much almond milk you put in and the pecans and stuff like that. But I calculated it pretty, pretty uh, roughly. It's anywhere between uh, 255 to 265 um, calories, about 10 grams of fat, um, about 10 to 15 net carbs. So it's really, really good and a whopping 50 to 55 grams of protein. So you're getting a lot of good protein right here, not that many um, calories, not that many carbs, and the fats that you are getting are healthy. 
So thanks once again for watching this video. Be sure to give this protein sludge a chance. Thanks once again for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. One that I've noticed that's really, really tough is it's that little ramp. A lot of people have a hard time. So it's basically, imagine someone you have to make, you have to run up a ramp and it's just inclines like this. And